Did you know NASA sent six scientists to Hawaii for a year to simulate life on Mars? But there were no beaches or daiquiris on this mission, more like lava and frozen food. After simulating life on Mars by living in a dome on one of the volcanoes of the island, the volunteers are finally set to return. In case you didn't know, NASA wants to send the first humans to Mars. That is why six scientists, three men and three women, spent a year testing if humans could live in those conditions. Aside from the habitability factor of trying to survive on Mars, the simulation also focused on how scientists would perform in isolation and how they would interact with each other in such conditions to avoid conflicts. Now there's a reality show I want to see. According to the report, they could come out only in a spacesuit and act like they were on Mars. They also had to deal with the 20-minute delay when communicating to base camp, which is the time it takes messages to travel to Earth from Mars and vice versa. Another challenge was being able to survive with very limited resources, including frozen food. So let's hope at least they attempted to be as resourceful as Matt Damon. I'm Maria Mercedes for Bus 60. Now you know, pass it on.